But anyway, so <laughs> here's here's what happened. Here's what happened. I had this kind of weird metaphysical moment. Right. Right. Tell me if you've anything like this has ever happened to you. Right. So we we've booked our pitch for like five o'clock. All right. Okay. And we arrive with 20 minutes to go. And there's all these kids. There's all these little kids. They're probably about 10 years old training. There's um, there's cones up and, and the, the guy has got their coach has got them training and running around. And we got, okay, 20 minutes later, yada, yada, yada. And we're hanging around and we just want to play now, really. And and then it gets to five o'clock. And the kids, obviously, they're still playing and, uh, you know, the coach is trying to wave them off, but they're not really listening. You know what I'm talking yeah, about? When yeah. you've got a large group of kids. They all have ADHD. I mean, <laughs> it's not like they're all going to just get up and, and, and goose step out, you know, <laughs> like like this is some kind of North Korean parade. Obviously, yeah. that's not going to happen. It takes a little bit of time. And I was not... Um, in the mood for any of this kind of stuff. I wasn't in the mood for any of this banter and I just started saying to them all, right, off you go, piss off, piss off, go on, off you go like that, right? And they're all just kind of looking at me, trying to engage with me, trying to banter with me, kind of chat with me and everything and, and thinking, oh, look, oh, now the grown-ups are going to play. Okay, well, you know, blah, blah, blah. And I'm just shooing them away, shooing them away. And then suddenly this moment just gripped me like from another dimension, because I just thought like, hey, I remember when I was a kid and I was playing with my friends and then you'd engage with some adult and this adult was just incredibly mean for no reason. <laughs> now and you're just kinda, that guy. And now I'm that guy. <laughs> I felt like I was staring some kind of, what are they called? I was staring down a wormhole. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Because I've been on both sides of it. Yeah. It was so weird. It just hit me. And I just remember, because I can relate more to, to that side of the, of the wormhole than I can to this one. Because this is the first time I've been a mean adult to a bunch of kids. Really? Well, of course. <laughs> And I, it just hit me like anything. It, it just hit me like something out of Back to the Future or something. There was something very like, something very kind of flux capacitor about this moment. I was like, oh, my God, Steve. You know, I guess everybody <laughs> turns. So these wormholes are coming for everybody. These wormholes Whoa. are coming for everybody. Like, well, they are, aren't they? They are, aren't they? Like. I, when I'm a mean old bastard like my granddad was when he was getting older or something like that. But I was just like, oh, my God, I'm a mean old adult. Well, when did this happen? I mean, you don't have to believe that the universe is, you know, that, that life is linear. You don't have to believe that if you don't want to. Who said, you know? I mean, you know, light sort of curves, doesn't it? Or, or is it or is it time? Time, time curves. Time space. Time curves curves, right? And some seriously <laughs> clever bastards had to figure that out. We need, what's that guy, the science guy here with us? Bill Nye, the science guy, or, or who's the other one? Yeah. yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, I, I suppose the, the logical question after that is next time there's a bunch of kids trying to banter with me, will I not be mean to them again? And I can tell you that the answer is no. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not. Why should I? 